Hey there, Mr. Hungry. It's been a minute. How are you doing? Hello. I've been good. I've been missing your cooking and I'm super hungry today, so I decided to stop by and see if you could make something for me. Of course. You see that giant kitchen behind you? It's stocked with everything, so is there anything you want in particular? Mmm, there's nothing I'm specifically craving. I'm just really hungry, so I want to eat a lot of food. A lot of food is what we have. Wait right here and I'll get started on your meal. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to see what you make for me. I'm really excited. Alright, let's get to work. We can use this part of the kitchen to make a few veggies. Start by using some magic green dough. Let's also use magic red dough. We'll use magic white dough as well. Now let's use magic orange dough. And we'll use a little more of the magic green dough. Okay, let's make our veggies. Here's a closer look at our green broccoli. Here's a closer look at our red tomato. Here's a closer look at our white mushroom. And here's a closer look at our orange carrot. Okay, let's put all of our veggies into a pot. Perfect. Now let's just cook the veggies on top of the stove for a bit. Awesome! Our veggies are ready. Let's go serve Mr. Hungry. Okay, here you go. Your first meal. Steamed veggies. Oh, uh, I mean, I'm very grateful and the veggies look good, but I hope this is just an appetizer because... Those veggies are not going to satisfy my hunger. Ah, don't worry, don't worry. I have plenty more food. Enjoy. Oh wow, those veggies were really good. Great selection too. All those veggies blended really well together in my mouth. Okay, what's next? I'm glad you enjoyed it. And I have the main course coming next. I didn't want to start your meal with something hefty, which is why I went with veggies first. Oh, I knew you wouldn't disappoint me. Hmm, I wonder what the main course is. If you haven't decided already, can you make something with meat in it? I already have something in mind, and don't worry. I think you're going to love this. Wait, right here. Okay, let's make the main course for Mr. Hungry. We're going to make him a sandwich, so let's start by using some magic brown dough to make the bread. Perfect. Now we're going to use magic red dough to make the sandwich meat. We'll use magic yellow dough to make the cheese. And we'll use magic green dough to make veggies. Awesome! Now let's squeeze out our ingredients. Excellent. Now let's slide this cutter to put our sandwich together. Nice! Here's a closer look at our ham and cheese sandwich. Let's put the sandwich on a plate. Now let's make a side dish using this magic yellow dough. We're making french fries. Give me a minute. Nice! Here's a closer look at our crispy french fries. Let's put the french fries next to the sandwich. Beautiful. Okay, Mr. Hungry, here comes the main course. Now this is what I'm talking about. How did you know I love sandwiches? And I love ham and cheese sandwiches the most. Those fries smell delicious too. I can't wait to try. Let's start with the sandwich. 
Enjoy! Aww. That sandwich was amazing. Packed with meat, cheese, and veggies. Each bite, I felt like I was in sandwich heaven. Can I try the fries now? Of course. Here you go. Aww. Mmm! Those fries were crispy and perfectly salted. They worked really well with the sandwich too. Overall, the main course gets an A++++. Nice! Glad you enjoyed the meal. Is there anything else you want? That sandwich got me really full, but I still have a little room for dessert. Of course you do. Okay, I'll make something for you right now. Hang tight. Alright, let's make a pie for Mr. Hungry using this magic yellow dough. Put the dough on this pie tray. Now let's put our pie in the oven. Awesome! Our pie's ready. Let's see how it turned out. Mmm! That smells very sweet. Here's a closer look at our pie. Okay, here's your dessert. Wow! You made a whole pie for me? What's the filling inside? Wait, don't tell me. I want to find out after I taste it. I'm so excited. Ah. That was the best apple pie I've had in my life. What a way to end my meal. Thank you. Are you still hungry? I can make you more. Oh, no, no. I can't eat another bite. Thank you so much for making me a three-course meal. I was not expecting that today. No problem. I had a ton of fun cooking everything for you today. Makes me happy that you enjoyed each dish. Haha, <laughs> I had a lot of fun eating all the dishes you made me. Thanks again, and I'll be back for more. Your cooking skills are incredible. Wow, I am very confused right now. I walked by this place yesterday, and there was no ice cream store. Now there is an ice cream store. What happened? Hey there. Didn't mean to confuse you. We're actually a traveling ice cream parlor and we set up shop here today. Okay, now everything makes sense. But that's really cool. A traveling ice cream parlor. I would like to try your ice cream if that's okay. Of course. That's why we're here. Is there anything in particular you want? Oh, I love ice cream so I want to try everything you have to offer. Bring out all of your top sellers. Okay, wait right here. Let me bring out a couple of pink serving plates. Alright, this is one of our top selling ice cream cones. And these are pretty popular too. It's our take on macarons. The fillings have our classic vanilla ice cream, and we make different flavored meringue cookies. Wow, what a fancy traveling ice cream parlor. I've never seen so many bright colors, but these best sellers look delicious. I can't wait to try. Uh, thank you. Start with the ice cream cone. Hope you like it. Ah. Wow! Was that syrup lavender? And that was the best vanilla ice cream I've ever had. No wonder it's a bestseller. Vanilla, lavender, and a sweet chocolate chip on top. That was perfect. I can't wait to try the macarons. Alright, try this lemon-flavored macaron first. Ah. Wow, the lemon macaron was delicious. Really love your take on it. The vanilla ice cream is a nice touch. Can I try eating the next two macarons together? I want to do a little experiment. Of course, we love where your head's at. This is our strawberry macaron. Ah, And here's our pistachio macaron. Never tried both together, so let us know how it goes. Wow, you need to pair them up. I was able to taste each flavor individually, but as you keep chewing, they start to blend together and then makes another awesome flavor. Oh wow, I love the description. Okay, I'll have to add that to the menu. Is there anything else you want? Oh yeah, of course. You have more? I have a couple more items on the menu. Let me bring them out for you right now. Alright, these items are pretty popular too. We have a sundae, 
And we also have a couple of popsicles too. This is a fruity one. And if you like chocolate, this one's for you. Yes! These items look wonderful. I would love to try all of them, please. I had a feeling you would say that. Okay, try this ice cream sundae first. Ah. Wow! There were so many flavors in my mouth. Chocolate, lemon, strawberry, and that whipped cream was so good. How did you get all those flavors to work? I'm impressed. I have to try the popsicles now. Thank you. Okay, we'll start with the chocolate popsicle first, and then end with the fruity one. Ah. Wow, you demolished that. Okay, here comes the fruity popsicle. Ah. Wow, just wow. It's so good. This is my new favorite ice cream shop. Can you please come by more often? Everything was incredible. Oh, wow, thank you. Yes, we'll definitely try to come by more often, but, uh, what's wrong with your teeth? Looks like things just magically appeared. Huh? What are you talking about? Ah! Ow! What? My teeth are starting to hurt. Uh-oh. Might partially be my fault, but I think you got cavities from eating too many sweets. You should go see a dentist. Hi there. Heard you rushed over here. What seems to be the problem? Hi, Doc. I was eating ice cream, and then my teeth started to hurt a lot after I finished eating. Hmm, okay. I might have an idea, but can you open your mouth for me? I'll have to check. Ah. Alright, I'm going to start by using this mouth mirror to check each tooth. Oh, might be a little more serious than I thought. Let me check the top. Yikes. Okay, similar situation up here. Alright, so after taking a closer look, you do have a couple of rotten teeth and a few cavities as well. I can't save the rotten teeth, but I will be able to drill the cavities out. So, you can't see right now, but you have a few brown spots on your teeth. Those are the cavities, and I'll be removing them by drilling a hole and then adding a filler. On top, you have a rotten tooth as well, and one cavity. So, most of the damage is on the bottom. I'll be able to fix all of these issues with ease. I only said it was a little more serious because I thought it was just cavities. But the rotten teeth we can take care of. Okay, so I'm going to use these tweezers to pluck out the rotten pink tooth. There we go. That was a clean rip. Now let's add a brand new tooth. Awesome. Okay, let's do the same for this yellow tooth. There we go. Replace it with a brand new tooth. Nice! Let's do a little check. Looks pretty strong here. And it looks pretty strong up here too. Now we have to take care of the cavities. Let's start with this one. Take care of the surface first. Now let's drill. Alright, now let's work on the other tooth. Drill again. Now it's time to add the filling. Perfect. Clean the teeth up. Awesome. Now let's work on this top tooth. Drill. And let's fill. Touch this up a bit. Awesome. Let's do one final check with this mouth mirror. This tooth looks good. This tooth also looks perfect. And this top tooth is A-OK. -okay. You're all set. How do you feel? What happened? The pain is completely gone. You're amazing. Thank you so much for fixing my teeth. No problem. This happened because you ate too many sweets for a long time. 
eating too many at once probably triggered it, but try to avoid eating sweets every day. Remember, everything in moderation and you'll be good. I do eat a lot of sweets. Thanks, Doc. I'll make a mental note of that. I'll definitely be watching my sugar intake. Thanks again. No more cavities for me. No problem. Hoping it doesn't, but if it does happen again, you know where to find me. Awesome or pop fans! Thank you so much for watching. We can't do this without you. If you're new to the channel and became a fan, click that subscribe button for more awesome stuff. And if you want to be the first person to watch our next video, hit that notification bell to have a chance. See ya!